hello friends i am back and today we're gonna go back to the vlogs you guys know i was doing daily vlogs then i got more into the chit chat type of situation and today we have a full jam pack day i've been having full jam pack days but i feel like today is gonna be a really 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 fun adventure that i could take you guys to so many new things have happened beginning with i have a new makeup routine so we're gonna start with this get ready with me and i'm gonna just walk you through some new products that i've got first let me tell you guys a little bit about what i'm doing today so there are a couple things happening today of course i'm the honorary plus one and we are going to a beach house in malibu to kickstart things and then i believe there's other little situations and whatnot but will everything's kind of up in the air but the malibu situation is not up in the air that is for a hair care beauty brand i think a hair dye beauty brand so but first let's get face ready i have about 30 minutes to get ready i thought it mm, maybe like an hour actually i went to a gifting suite and for you guys who don't know what a gifting suite is it's like an event and they just gift you things that's basically it and a friend of a friend was able to put me on this like list and i got so much makeup and hair care and a whole bunch of stuff i'll give you guys a full haul later on but right now let's focus on some of the products that i just got i got the smashbox photo finish smooth and blur which i've really been liking and then this it's a primer and a setting mist from giovanni and then i actually purchased this one it's the milk makeup cloud glow and i i actually mm, I would say I like this one the best because it's really soft. It comes out like this. Oh, this one's closed. Wait. I think I have an opened one. Comes out nice and soft and a little bit also goes a long way. And it's just like, I don't know if you guys have tried the Trader Joe's sunscreen it's like a really velvety texture so many changes have been taking place i've really been nurturing my instagram because i kind of got like a big boom on there and for you guys who don't know i'm kind of accidentally a foodie while i'm simultaneously working on this like futuristic kind of series i posted it to my shorts if you haven't seen make sure you guys go check that out because my boyfriend took a really long time editing it i actually like to change up my makeup routine a lot of the time so i saw this girl go in with like the darker stuff like the the contour and that's another smashbox product that i do have it's the halo and i really like this as well it's like a little okay so guys new changes going on in my life i am now taking vitamins vitamins that i had written in my notes so long ago and never actually committed to the vitamin but now i am I'm committed to vitamins and I actually have been feeling so much better. I'm back in the gym and I am not drinking. I would like to say that I don't have a problem with alcohol, but I do go to a lot of events that serve free alcohol, but I'm going to New York Fashion Week and I'm trying to feel my absolute best. And I know that drinking alcohol is only fun for the moment, but it's not good for your gut health. It's not good for anything. Like, it's so counterintuitive to be going to the gym and then drinking. And I think it was a sign from God because, all right, usually when there's events like the one that we got invited to today, they usually have an open bar. But we read the email. There is no open bar. But there are mocktails. And for you guys who don't know what mocktails are, cocktails but in a mocking way meaning there is no alcohol in there this is like a really good time for you guys to go ahead comment and share what's new in your guys's lives anything that you guys are working on things that you're proud of any changes I would, like when you set a certain goal you meet it there's nothing that feels better than that it's kind of like when i go on the treadmill i do i do 20 minutes on a 15 incline at a three speed level but when i hit the 10 minute mark i already am like i'm good you know like i'm cool off this but i i don't stop i keep going well i know i feel much better after the 20 minutes even though it's like annoying versus if i stop midway i'm not gonna feel better just because i stopped while i was tired i feel like stopping the moment you get tired is also counterintuitive to a workout or to strengthening anything it goes beyond the gym it really becomes a mindset thing because 
if you can keep going when you're tired if, if you can keep going when things feel difficult then i feel like you're already doing much better than a huge percentage of people and then i'm gonna change into like a night look later on so stay tuned to see how i work on my day versus night look but my camera is it seems like it's almost gonna die it's probably an hour later from when i started my makeup kind of went with like a pink I did some lashes, which I usually don't do. It was a tough battle. For a moment, I actually hated the makeup. I probably should have chosen my outfit before the makeup, or I should have stuck to neutrals. I don't know, just something about the light pink didn't feel like me at all whatsoever, but we're in too deep, okay? I'm gonna show you guys the outfit once we get there, so let's get going. Even the outfit was an upward battle. I was ready to just completely give up, but I think I ended up with something really cute. So wait till we get on over there and you guys can see the outfit. Oh. It's been so long. Guys, 10 more minutes until we reach our destination, but I am going absolutely fucking mad. Like, I was drinking matcha earlier. Like the matcha caffeine is hitting me like a truck. I'm juiced. I'm ready to run a mile, but I'm too caffeinated, dude. I'm too caffeinated. I'm too caffeinated. Ah. I have arrived. It's like a real cute. They, they have churros. They have churros. And um, I just parked my my car right here. This G wagon. It's not my car, but I'm manifesting. And I see, I see gift bags. I see gift bags and I see churros. Let me show you guys. It smells so good too. Oh my God. Look at my beautiful, handsome date. Something absolutely everywhere. Like I thought it ended here. We're gonna grab a mocktail in a bit. No alcohol. But it keeps going. This is good. Passion fruit, yuzu, very lemony, very citrusy. Oh yeah. Right down your alley. I think we just get plummeted into different settings to change the scenery for where we edit or have a chat. Yeah, I haven't tried the churros, haven't tried the mini pancakes. I can literally see the ocean from here. Also, side note, I heard that rent here. Not, I don't know if it's rent or mortgage. It's rent. Rent? It's, yeah, the house sold and they're just having for rent. They're 35000 a month. I think the math on that a year is like 500000 I didn't do the actual math. It's like 420000 Okay, so I was close. I guesstimated 500. I don't think Tati watches my videos, but I'm wearing her heels. But she had said it was okay for me to wear her heels. So that's what we're I doing. Think she watches them. Do you think she watches them? She watches all my vlogs. Really? Yeah. I don't know if she watches my vlogs. I think she does. Yeah, that'd be cute. I hope. I hope she does. Hi, Tati. I hope you watch my vlogs and know that I am wearing your black pointy heels once again they're kind of saving my life right now i have no heels right now guys so she's gonna post this in my story and be like oh, Andrea. <laughs> i hope she does watch this i'm not gonna say anything so we'll see and then i'll wait a week after posting this and i'll be like hey there's a, a hidden part in one of my vlogs wrap at the event i got these really cute polaroids now we're heading home it's gonna be about an hour ish give or take and then we are gonna get re-ready to go out for the night all right so my boyfriend said there's like another part of the night something about like like destroyer or like loner or something or whatever so he just had to wear all black so i changed my makeup to match the vibe i guess so we'll see what we get into like this really suits my face so much more 
the light pink was not really my vibe. All right, guys, this is the final part of the night. We're gonna go judge an album release party. You know, I get real judgmental about these, so we're gonna see if this artist is doing it up or not. public album release party which we were not aware of but i mean it looked like the fans had a lot of fun album release parties can go like either direction either it caters to like a small like intimate guest list or it's like a big thing for the fans i guess it really just depends i'm not sure who makes these decisions i don't know if it's the label i don't know if it's the artists themselves i'm not sure like what the whole deal is but they took like a like a concert route we didn't stay until the concert we we're just really tired we, but i want to show you guys everything that i got at overtone overtone is a hair brand that is designed to like give you a tone over your hair the lighter you have your hair the more it's gonna like tone it to this color so i don't really know what my hair would look like and i didn't just get ginger i got a couple colors i kind of want i'm interested in seeing like the smell I actually was talking to the CEO. She was such a nice lady. We're sitting there and chatting. I guess it only takes 10 to 15 minutes and it lasts two to three weeks. So I got the black one because I have been wanting to do black hair, but I don't want to box dye my black hair. Put little glasses in here, which I thought was so funny because what am I going to do? I'm going to decorate the glasses. I don't have my glasses on right now, but you guys know I do the little pizzazzle to them. So I might actually drop these as one of ones. It's, like, it's called the Gloss, and it's like a Shine Reviving Treatment Mask. Oh, this is the Reviver for Curly Hair. I will probably give this to Brittany, honestly. This is the Style Shield, which is heat protectant spray, which we always need. Like, they really packed it up. Honestly, like, these always just feel like gifts from the universe. I went to this other gifting suite. I think I told you guys about it earlier. And I'll go into all of that in a different video because they gave me so many things. And I've tried a couple. So I'm gonna tell you guys about the products that I really like. So the Remedy for Fine Hair Colorless Hair Mask. So yeah, all the, the thing is that they have the color hair masks and then these colorless hair masks. Oh, this one is really easy to open. Oh my God, it smells like minty. We got a brush. This is nice. I seem to get gifted exactly what I need at that given time. I think this just means I need a little change in hair. So I think the video after this is going to be me doing overtone to my hair. I don't know which color I'm going to do next, but we're going to see how it works. And as you guys have seen, I haven't been posting. It's, I've been taking care of my Instagram first and foremost just because i have been seeing so much growth on there and that doesn't mean if you don't see growth in one place to abandon it because i'm still pushing i'm still going and i do see growth youtube is gonna be a long game and that's okay vibrant silver and then a bright pink so let me know which ones you guys think i should do and i will consider it so thank you guys so much for watching thank you overtone this is not a paid sponsorship. This was just me having a good time at an event.